हेलो एंड वेलकम दिस इज हेना तलाटी एंड यू आर वाचिंग इट्स टुमारो न्यूज सिक्स मैग्नीट्यूड अर्थक्वेक स्ट्राइक्स ऑफ इंडोनेशिया कोस्ट व्हिच किल्स मोर देन सिक्स डैमेजिंग हंड्रेड्स ऑफ द होम्स एज वेल एज स्कूल्स गवर्नमेंट ऑफिसेस एंड मॉस्क एक्सक्रॉस द रीजन इट वाज सेंटर्ड इन द वाटर्स फोर्टी फाइव किलोमीटर साउथ ऑफ मलांग डिस्ट्रिक्ट इन ईस्ट जावा प्रोविंस एट द डेप्थ ऑफ एटी टू किलोमीटर्स The earthquake shook the tourist spot Bali. There had been aftershocks but there was no risk of tsunami the Indonesian Geophysics Agency said. Still people are urged to stay away from the slopes of soil or rocks that have the potential for landslides. The tremor shook Malang a city of several million people. It was pretty strong and went for a long time and everything seemed to be swaying this strong earthquake killed at least seven persons and damaged buildings on indonesia's mainland of java and shook the tourist spot of bali falling rocks killed a woman on motorcycle and badly injured her husband in east java's lumangjang district A report showed people running in panic from malls and buildings in several cities of East Java province. As per Indonesia's search and rescue agency, several houses and buildings were damaged including a ceiling at a hospital in Blitar was destroyed in the city neighboring to Malang. Reports of damage included parliamentary buildings, schools, a hospital and houses in several cities while a large gorilla statue in an amusement park in the town of Batu lost its head. Several communities had been evacuated in the affected region. Another moderate magnitude 5.3 earthquake was felt in Indian Ocean 78 km south of Beltar. East Java, Indonesia on 11th April at 6.54 a.m. morning. Indonesia, a vast country of 270 million people, is frequently struck by earthquakes, volcanic eruptions and tsunamis because of its location on the ring of fire, an arc of volcanoes and fault lines in the Pacific Basin. It experiences very frequent seismic and volcanic activity as it is positioned where tectonic plates collide. This quake was the second deadly disaster to hit Indonesia this past week. Last Sunday, a downpour resulting from tropical cyclone Saroja killed at least 165 people and damaged thousands of the houses. Somewhere buried in either mudslides or solidified lava from a volcanic eruption in November while others were swept away by the flashing flood. In January, a magnitude 6.2 earthquake killed at least 105 people and injured nearly 6,500 while more than 92,000 were displaced after striking in West Sulawesi province in Indonesia. In 2018, a 7.5 magnitude quake, a subsequent tsunami in Palu in Sulawesi Island left more than 4,300 people dead or missing. On December 26, 2004, a huge 9.1 magnitude earthquake struck off the coast of Sumatra and triggered a tsunami that killed 2,20,000 throughout the region including around 1,70,000 in Indonesia. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Hena Talati. For more weather updates like this and please subscribe our channel.